Hey everyone, it's Rad, and I want to thank Keen for they are the sponsor of this video. And don't skip ahead, for I do have a special and exciting announcement to uh, make, including a very, very special gift for anyone who is watching, which I will get to it a uh, soon. For those who doesn't know Keen, this amazing website provides you with an access to a vetted psychics, spiritual advisors who can provide a guidance and insight in into life's challenges, into clarity in love, into relationships, and as well into career and, and many, many more. And Keen, it is a one of the most uh, affordable way to get an instant psychic reading with a professional at any time, 24 seven. What I love about Keen is that it is perfect for anyone who wants to talk with someone right away, anytime, anywhere there is no wait and it is excellent if you do have a burning question that literally needs an answer right now and it is double perfect for if you are on a budget too and here is where my gift for you guys is coming in for anybody who wants to talk with advisor on keen just click my link in the description down below and you get a 10 minutes for just only two dollars and just see for yourself for i do support keen and i have been around the block a lot when it comes to um psychics readers and especially prophets and i can tell you that there are those who are false but uh judging by the way keen found me i can tell you that they are venting their uh advisors uh, very carefully and you i do encourage you to try it out especially if you do have questions that i cannot answer like for example about health like for example about a reallocation because Saro is just not designed for that uh, for example as well yes or no questions as well guys it's only two dollars for 10 minutes and i cannot think of a better way to try it out and uh, get the clarity you seek so there are a uh, tarot readers, psychic readers, uh, love and relationship advisors, and as well spiritual advisors there. Uh, and you can take your time to make a selection of the reader of your choice, establish a bond, which is going to establish as well a goal, be it a uh, intention setting, be it a, a chakra clearing, be it healing, manifesting, and many, many more. And what is also amazing there is that Keen provides every customer of theirs with a monthly discount, which is a um, clearly a way to show you that they do appreciate you being there and it also provides you with a way to afford multiple readings should you need so the signing up process very simple i'm going to show you how all that you have to do is just watch my screen very few simple clicks for their website it is made intuitively and it's just you cannot get it wrong and just in these few simple clicks you are get yourself ready to make your selection of uh, readers and dive into your spiritual journey right away so to use my gift just click in the link in the description box and get your 10 minutes with a keen advisor of your choosing for just only two us dollars and and see for yourself how amazing they really are with the variety of their uh, advisors and as well the prices which have a ton of variety too should you be on a budget thank you keen for sponsoring this video Hello, my friends welcome to the channel and in this video we're gonna check on your week uh 28th of february up until the 3rd of march not the 3rd the 6th of march 2022nd and uh if you do enjoy it guys if you do enjoy the show uh make sure you do subscribe for the channel leave a like hit the notification bell so you do not miss any of our weekly uploads and as well our live streams so with that said let's uh check on what's your week is going to be like and uh, with the first card the 10 of uh, pentacles i hope your week is going to be great and you are going to uh, and uh the cards are going to are going to have that positive incentive oh my god my words are coming hard today so uh the second one that is going to be the uh chariot followed by the third one of the five of pentacles uh moving next we do have the seven of cups and uh the last one that stands as the page of swords so it's uh 
it's a week where you may kind of find yourself trying a little bit too hard and it is needed but luckily for what i can see you are to correct that behavior and that approach you may be trying way too hard into your relationship or maybe trying way too hard into your uh, career either way uh, it seems that you are going to draw a line here into this week and find out not what you are doing wrong but where you are kind of like surplusing in investment which isn't a good thing uh, so starting up the week here for you with the ten of pentacles uh, the start of the week should be really good about at least by judging of, of this card it is because it shows that whatever investments whether these investments are financial investments or emotional investments they're going to be placed in the right spot at least at that time and that is going to make you feel very good it's going to make you feel very uh liberated independent you name it it's just is going to make you feel that you are the place where you belong with the person that you belong with okay or at the job that you belong with uh, or that you belong at and so on and so forth now additional thing about the ten of pentacles it is that you may have a chance to reconcile that point and should that be the case i think that this is where exactly you are to give a little bit more than you should that is because we do have the chariot card afterwards and that card kind of concerns that good place which you're going to find yourself into okay it is because you are to see the look of your hard work okay you are you are to see your achievements starting to fulfill themselves therefore you are to see the rewards and you are going to be really proud of yourself but you're going to tell to tell a lot tell to yourself that point is that if i press harder probably i'm going to get even more well that's not exactly the case is because everything has its limits okay you cannot kind of like um work in a job that can pay you just that much and expect a bigger pay just because you gave a more efforts and thus here the chariot carries on this kind of like lack of balance into your incorporation uh, against what you can gain from the situation at that point and uh, that obviously that may leave a feeling of disappointment you know you are trying so hard and yet things doesn't budge even a uh, uh how can i put it into words even a step further from where they are at that particular point and so what is going to be important here is to like i said at the start of the reading just draw a line and uh think of you know how you are addressing your situations which we do have with the five of pentacles <clears throat> and at the middle of the week you are going to see that there are problems into into your situations but these problems are not going to be exterior problems they're going to be problems that are creating of your surplus investment you know surplus investment into emotions surplus investment into finances into uh, efforts as well just to think it that way you are trying so hard to get in touch again with this person and they just don't have the physical ability to reply and that's a problem isn't it so it's a problem created by your surplus investment into it. And so with the five of pentacles here, uh, at the middle of the week, you're going to say to yourself, you know, just, just wait a minute for a second. There is a, something really wrong going on with the style I am approaching that situation. And so I have to kind of like change the style. And that is exactly what happens at the mid and the late stages of your week here with uh, the seven of cups because the seven of cups here points that you are going to understand two things okay one of them it is that whatever vision you do have for the future of that comfortable environment you are in it's very possible but it you you just can't force it okay you just can't push it to happen overnight for example or faster than the time due and uh the second that leads to the second thing you are going to realize it is that you gotta be objective all right you gotta take a small and how can i put it into words uh objective simple steps toward manifesting whatever your vision is at that point whether it is to marry whether it is you know to get a better job uh whether it is uh to simply be happy because if you do over invest and if you try to push 
it's not like you are going to provoke many problems like physical problems it's just you are going to be following disappointment after disappointment after disappointment which is kind of not needed at all right and so instead of kind of like having these disappointments that are bouncing bouncing you back at the start trying a new it will be better if you don't fly into the cloud nine for example and just be objective about the situation the person you're interested in don't have the time to answer all of your approach or every approach you make so do little uh, do less approach the job doesn't have the money to pay you extra for your extra time well don't go for extra time just don't do extra time use it for something different right and uh, that is going to lead you guys uh, to the end of the week here, which is a person who shows up. And that is a little bit of a different story. Uh, we do have the three of wands that it is catalyzing uh, this individual. So page of swords with the three of wands. And that is somebody who uh, kind of like has a very different opinion about you not in a bad way what, what i'm trying to say here is that this individual sees in you something that nobody else does almost like this one here can look behind the curtains right and uh what they what they estimate with that perception of you it is that together you can you can be very or rather like you can be very well together whether it is in a business venture or a friendship you know or at some kind of a cooperation there why not romance as well if that's uh if that's what you crave for um but if you do decide to interact and to see where this is going very quickly you are going to become compatible it is just I, I don't know what kind of a word to use here very quickly you will become compatible it is just you will realize that this person likes the same things you do this person also sees things the same way you do they have almost the same goals like you and and so on and so forth so you you do have a lot in common and therefore you can accomplish a together if you do carry on together you can accomplish a big things and uh, in that uh, sense the page of sorts here above everything else it does mean that at the end of the week whether you need it or not you are going to have an unexpected help coming your way and another thing that this uh, person is going to uh, make for you or is going to make you realize it is that you do need a clean a cleansing cleaning a purge in your social circle when you see how genuine they are when you see what they see in you you will you would wish every single friend you have to be like that and those who are not even remotely coming that way well these people you will realize that they have to go and uh so that's uh that is going to be uh your week and i know that you virgo can be meticulous you are willing to give a hundred percent into things you believe in but at the end of the day, uh, it's just it has to go both ways, right? You can't give everything you got and not getting everything that you deserve, guys. Okay? Just it cannot go all the time that way. So eventually, you have to put a brakes, and it seems that the brakes you are to put are into this week, February twenty eighth, up until March sixth, twenty twenty second. So yeah, that being said, that was your uh, weekly reading. Hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like it, guys. And we are to see each other uh, next time. Until then, bye.